Hello everyone, I am James and you are watching Good Times Tech YouTube channel. Today let's see what's the problem with this air sprayer. Sorry, airbrush. This is called as airbrush. It is usually used to spray paint on edible things that is maybe while preparing a cake or any other sweets they used to spray the paint using this device so here the problem with this device is that it is not spraying it is switching on as you can see here but it's not spraying it's not spraying the paint or whatever liquid it is and for testing purpose I have put some water inside you can see there is water inside but it's not spraying so let's see why the paint is not being sprayed, the water is not being sprayed. For that, turn it off first. Then we will remove this. The spray nozzle. According to the client, they said that this gun, it fell down from their hand and it stopped working. So. I will tighten it and check it once again as it was loose there. Okay. No, it's not spraying. So as I have tightened it, it's not working. Now it's working, but there is no spray coming out. Okay, so for that, turn it off. Open it. Let the water be inside, no, no worries about the water. Now for that, we will remove this. We will disassemble it completely and reassemble. And check whether the problem gets solved. This is the nut for holding the needle remove this needle as we remove the needle the water flows out as you can see so let me remove the water first so let me empty the chamber liquid chamber So let's continue now. Okay, I emptied the water. Now take out the needle. Okay. Then be careful while removing all the parts. It may happen that you may lose some part. And if you lose any small tiny part, it is difficult to get it back. Remove it carefully. Okay. So now we will insert it. See that this point it enters into the hole inside. I'll zoom and show it. Here you see the hole inside this point the arm this is then operating operating lever which you can which is used to control the spray amount of paint sprayed or the pressure and this is the operating needle okay this needle should enter into the hole here the needle should enter into the hole this is the operating lever and the needle here so it should enter the into the hole
and you should be able to see it here on the back side you can see the needle or the operating guide okay now insert it here inside and turn it okay okay now we'll insert the stopper and spring spring case and needle checking guide so this is the needle checking guide and the spring then the checking nut do not leave this operating lever unless and until you insert the needle if you remove it it will come out so now fasten the needle by using this nut now let's and let's insert the handle adjustment and the adjustment screw this is the adjustment screw so to adjust the operating lever as you can see here ok Now we will connect, fix this on the compressor and check it, insert some water. That's enough for testing, close it, close the lid, start the gun. As you can see it's spraying. So let's check. As you can see now it's spraying. The paint is being sprayed. I'm using water for testing purpose. Spraying the water was easy. Now let us check with the paint itself. Edible paint. This is a metallic yellow. I'm not going to spray much. Let's not waste the paint. Cover the cap. Start the machine. Now let us spray and check the metallic color. Whether the gun will work for metallic airbrush will work for metallic paint. For that, just to see. This paint spray for metallic the airbrush is working for metallic spray as you can see. <coughs> so hope this video was helpful for you in repairing your airbrush. If this video was helpful for you kindly hit the like icon, share the video and subscribe to our channel if you are not yet subscribed. Thank you for watching everyone.